The Pilatus PC-12 is an excellent family transportation airplane, but what if one of the family members is wheelchair-bound and unable to climb the entry stairs? A New York-based company owns two PC-12s and was faced with this problem for one of its frequent travelers. Instead of adapting a wheelchair to somehow fit on the PC-12 stairs, the company's pilot and industrial designer Gideon Clement came up with a simpler idea. He took advantage of the PC-12's big cargo doorway and designed a lifting system that can load a wheelchair carrying a passenger with a total weight of 300 pounds right into the cabin. The usual configuration for carrying a handicapped passenger is to remove one side of the double club seating area. The lifting system is installed temporarily in the seat mounting structure next to the cargo door. First, a metal plate is mounted to the seat rails. Then, the lifting mechanism's riser is latched to the plate with a simple quick release mechanism. Attached to the riser is a machined aluminum platform on which the wheelchair sits. The clever part of the mechanism is how the platform is raised into the airplane. The riser consists of a long jack screw, and the platform is attached to the nut that rides up and down the jack screw. Instead of designing a complex integrated motor, Clement chose to use a simple electric drill that connects to a socket to spin the jack screw, and thus raise and lower the platform. The electric drill solution saves weight and eliminates many possible points of failure. However, he carries two drills with the lift kit to avoid getting stuck if one drill fails. Because the system is not permanently installed, no regulatory approval is required. All of the hardware fits into two carry bags, and it can be carried as cargo and used at the destination. Total system weight is about 57 pounds. While the lift is designed for the PC-12, it could be adapted to other aircraft with similarly large and easily accessed cargo doors. After applying for a patent on the concept, Clement has worked with ProStar Aviation in New Hampshire to manufacture and distribute the lifting device, which he calls the ProStar Lift. <laughs>